BlizzCon was full of announcements this year, however it left fans more disappointed than ever about their favorite action RPG franchise. Everyone was waiting for a new Diablo title, possibly Diablo 4, but I guess everyone would be happy with a spin-off title as well. Blizzard had only a Diablo mobile game to announce and kept us hanging by saying that they're working on more Diablo related projects that they can't yet share. As much as we would have wanted to continue grinding on Diablo 3 before a sequel gets released, we should all have our options open wide. We'd like to share with you some worthy mentions, Diablo-like isometric action RPGs and some that are soon to be released. Are you looking for something to forget about Diablo for a while? I'm Wes Malik from Segment Next and here are 10 action RPG games that can scratch your Diablo 4 itch for the time being. Titan Quest Much like the Diablo franchise, Titan Quest is well respected among the action RPG fanbase. The game shares the same battle tactics as Diablo and its design is similar as well, although you can tell that it is a bit outdated. Even so, its last expansion made the game a classic for action RPG fans. The anniversary edition of Titan Quest costs $20 on Steam and will keep you hooked for days even without any friends to grind together. It's definitely worth the while. Path of Exile If you want something that looks and feels exactly like Diablo but is free and has a constant flow of updates, then Path of Exile is your kind of game. Grinding Gear Games has set an example for free-to-play games with this one, as it's overflowing with free content, has no pay-to-win microtransaction, and its gameplay is flawless. If you have to compare it to Diablo, Path of Exile shares the same dark design of Diablo 2 with the replayability of the third game. Couldn't recommend this one enough. MU Legend The internet is divided on this one. Is it Mu Legend, Mu Legend, or MU Legend? If you have grown up with well, whatever this legend is, then this one might pique your interest. Undeniably, MU Legend doesn't share the same feelings as the classic MMO, but as an action RPG, it does its job perfectly. Mew Legend has been brought to the West by WebZen and we're excited about being able to play it even though we can't pronounce it properly. However, the guys did a bad job with its microtransaction system adapting to the Western model so you might face some issues on that matter. If what you want is flashy animations and extra looking characters, then check this one first, no matter how it's pronounced. The Incredible Adventures of Van Helsing the Incredible Adventures of Van Helsing has a bunch of titles up its back, each with its own unique feel and features. Apart from magic and fantasy, this franchise is filled with weird science experiments, unique characters, and a dark setting. If you haven't jumped into the trilogy already, we suggest you grab the Incredible Adventures of Van Helsing Final Cut, which merges all the trilogy stories into one unique experience. What this game lacks, though, is the long-term effect that Diablo 3 offers. This is one downside, though, as the game can keep you interested in the action RPG genre until Diablo 4 gets finally announced. Grim Dawn Grim Dawn isn't a new title in the action RPG genre, however, it is one of the most notable ones. Many Diablo 3 players will tell you that they've started this game in hopes of finding their next favorite game and they haven't left it after that. The standalone game costs $24.99 and its first expansion launched back in 2017. A new expansion called Forgotten Gods is set to release in early 2019, so there's more to this game to look forward to. This is the perfect time for you to start playing it, so that you can be accustomed to its gameplay before the new expansion gets released. Lineage Eternal Former Lineage players will know this one and are probably waiting impatiently for its release. Lineage Eternal or Project TL has faced numerous delays to its release date, but that doesn't stop fans from hoping it will release soon. We don't know much about this title other than it's an action RPG title set in the world of Lineage. It has a bunch of different classes and from what we've seen it's an RPG worthy of its name. Last update we had about Lineage Eternal wants its release date to be set for 2019 so it might not be that long before you get to play it too along with the playtesters. Wolken Lords of Mayhem If you want to try out an action RPG that is still early on but bears great expectations, you should try out Wolken Lords of Mayhem. This action RPG includes a big world that is open for you to explore from the get-go and cool abilities to try out. 
To tie that all together, Wolken has incredible graphics for a game of its caliber and can easily stand up to other action RPG titles that are far more expensive. Its price on Steam? $19.99. But there's a catch. Wolken doesn't have co-op gameplay. Its studio has announced that they're working on such a feature. It will require some time for that to happen though. Do you want our honest opinion? This game is far too good for its current price, especially when co-op will be introduced. Considering it's still in early access, you should grab it now. You don't know how much this price will go up when it gets released and more features get introduced. Torchlight Frontiers As you might already know, the developing studio of the original Torchlight games, Runic Games, has shut down last year, leaving fans with one question. What will happen to the franchise? Thankfully, Extra Games is working on a new entry to the series, Torchlight Frontiers. To those that want a game like Diablo right now, go ahead and try the previous two games. If you've played them already, be a bit patient. Torchlight Frontiers has a 2019 release date and includes all things we love about the franchise. Bright cartoony graphics, intense gameplay mixed with new unique features. Let's hope it won't be long before we'll be able to play it. Lost Ark Lost Ark is one of those games that we've been waiting for for years and only now we get to see more of it. Lost Ark was released in Korea only a few days ago with its western release still not announced. Players outside of Korea have found ways to play the game but still have to struggle with all the quests and items being in Korean. If you can get past that, this is one solid action RPG to try out. Plus, it's still new, so you won't face issues in finding more players to quest with. Warhammer Chaos Bane Last, but certainly not least, we have Warhammer Chaos Bane. The game was first revealed back in September and it's set for release in 2019. What's interesting about Chaos Bane is that it looks way more similar to Diablo 3 than any Warhammer game we've seen so far. Let's be realistic, it's an action RPG, it's set in the Warhammer universe, so count us in. We might not know when it's getting released or what price it's going to be, but we have high hopes for this one. We hope all these games will make you stay in the isometric action RPG genre until Diablo 4 gets announced. Some of the titles we mentioned, if not all, have huge potential and in some cases can even be considered better than Diablo 3. Whether you'll wait for the next title in the Diablo franchise or you'll find a new personal favorite from that list is totally up to you. Did you find any of those RPGs interesting enough for you to try them out? Do you have any more to recommend? Let us know in the comments below and share with us your own personal favorites. Don't forget to subscribe to Segment Next for more videos like this and hit the bell button to get notifications whenever we upload something new. Until next time!